So last week I chopped planet Earth completely in half and everybody died. So I could either apologize and say that I'll never do it again, or I can embrace my role as the evil supervillain and do something bigger and better. Yeah, I choose that one. You guys told me in the comments there's a brand new update, and I can already see on the right side that there's some new ways to destroy this Earth. So let's jump right back in. If you guys want to see more Solar Smash on the channel, don't forget to smack that like button, and don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new. Okay, first things first, I want to see what these three new categories are. So this one is definitely new. I don't know what the heck that thing is, but it looks like some sort of a monster snake. Okay, that just gives me the creeps. And then... I, I, I don't even want to think about what that thing is. It looks like some sort of an octopus that may or may not eat the entire earth. So I, I have no idea. I'm going to start with this snake looking thing and I'm going to aim right for my house. I live right about there in Pennsylvania. Sorry, me. Okay. Is it work? Oh my gosh. Oh, um, I have all the regrets. I already regret my decision. Oh, Oh, okay. Well, I'm gone. Most of the United States is also gone. And who knows what's going to happen to the rest of the planet. This is terrible. 412 million people have already died. Can I zoom in a little bit? Oh, yes, I can. Oh, yes, I can. What is this monster doing? Okay, now he's in South America. I didn't even aim for South America. I'm sorry, Brazil. It's not my fault. Oh, my goodness gracious. This is crazy. So this guy just kind of roams around the planet and eats whatever he wants. Apparently he eats oceans and land and 966 million people also. Okay, this is terrifying. He's literally digging tunnels in the planet. Look at that. With ease, he just dug through the planet. Is he leaving? Is he leaving to like go terrorize Mars or the, or the moon or something like that? I'm going to name him. What should I? Wait, let me zoom out. I want to name him. I'm gonna name him, um, he looks, he looks like an Eddie. He looks like an Eddie to me. Thank you, Eddie. Um, 6.822 billion people are still alive, so I guess Eddie could have been worse. Okay, I reset the world from the destruction of Eddie. Let's go with this thing now. Again, no idea what this is. It looks like some sort of an octopus. I'm gonna aim for OB this time. So OB lives somewhere in Arizona. I'm gonna aim for Arizona. Sorry, buddy. I hope this doesn't bother you. Okay. Whoa. What? Oh. This thing is the size of the planet. This thing is... The oh. What? Okay. It was not only an octopus. It was an octopus that eats planets. Yep. I, I mean, it eats entire planets. Over a billion people just died. 1.08 billion people just died. I know last week you guys were telling me, Brandon, that says million, but yeah, it's 6.708 billion. So 6,000 million equals a billion. Okay, look at this. I mean, he literally put a crater th the size of, of the moon, basically, which is crazy. I mean, while I'm here, I might as well put a hole through Earth. Let me take the moon and I can just shoot the Earth with multiple moons. I know there's only one moon in real life, but in this game, there's unlimited moons. So I'm just going to shoot maybe maybe five or six more moons just to put a hole right through planet Earth. I think I did it. I think I did it. If I curl around. Yep. Look at that. I just put a, a hole through the entire Earth. It kind of looks like a donut. Ah, back to a fresh globe with no destruction from me. Okay, well, that's not going to last long. What's this little rocket ship looking thing? I have no idea. Also, if you guys didn't see last week's video, they have different worlds. So I can either go here. I believe that's Mars. No, I didn't want to go there, Brandon. Oh, my goodness. So you got Mars. You've got like some futuristic planet over here. I think this is Venus, but it might just be the moon. I, yeah, I think it is the moon because last week I called this Venus and you guys were like, Brandon, that's literally the moon. You can look out your window and see it. And I'm calling it Venus. Clearly, I'm not very good at astronomy. Okay, what else do we have over here? We've got another futuristic planet that kind of looks like the Death Star, like I said last week. You've got, uh, I think this is, oh, you know what? I think this is Jupiter. Okay, because you, I, I called this one Venus too. And then you guys were like, Brandon, you're being dumb. That's Jupiter. So I think this is Jupiter, which boys go to Jupiter to get more stupider. That's what kids used to say to me when I was a kid. And then over here, I don't know what this is, but it kind of looks like 
Uh, I don't- it sort of looks like planet Earth. Maybe this is another distant Earth that has 3.6 billion people on it. I don't know. And then this is new. So like I said, there's been a new update. I don't know what this is. I can make my own world. Oh, no way. Okay, I'm going to be playing more of this game. I could create my entire own world. Wait, what's this? So I can make the sun stronger. Whoa. I could turn the sun off and just create an ice age. I can make more water. So then it's like all ocean. Okay, wait, wait. I'm going back to planet Earth, but I want to come back and create my own world. I'm going to call it the frustrated gamer world. Okay, that's a terrible name. You guys are going to have to help me out in the comments. For next video, let me know in the comments, what do you want me to name my own world? And I will take the best name and put it in the video. One thing I want to do before I try this new rocket ship, I want to go back to the octopus and I want to put it in slow mode. So, okay, now we're in slow mo. I want to look... Oh, jeez! I can't even tell it's in slow mode. Holy nutcrackers. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Oh... Look at that, it's coming out of like a cloud. Okay, this looks like it's straight out of a horror movie. Look at this. It's got like eight tentacles, maybe more. Okay, maybe this isn't even an octopus. Let's count. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If it is eight. Okay, so I just discovered the world's largest octopus. Why isn't it doing anything? Hey! Hey, octopus, there's 7.788 billion people that are waiting to get destroyed. I have a rep. Oh. Oh. Okay, yep, there it goes. There it goes, destroying Earth. A and before I know it, look at that. 1.7 billion people already dead. Already dead, and we're not even done yet. Wow, look at that damage. That is such a beautiful view. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe there's still 6 billion people still alive. I mean, like I said last week, look at this, like, South, like, the South Pole can't have that many people. I think this game says that there's six million people living in the South Pole. I'm calling bogus on that. But over here, you got Australia. They're chilling. They're making shrimp on the Barbie. They don't even know that there's a giant octopus that just killed almost two billion people. They don't even care. China over here is unaffected. India, nothing. You've got Yemen and Omen over here. Africa, untouched. They don't they haven't even noticed that the entire United States of America is now just a giant lava crater. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay, let's reset this one more time. Let's take it out of slow mode. And now I want to see what this bad boy is. So this is the next update. If there's any new updates in the game, guys, let me know in the comments. I don't know what this is, but it looks like some sort of a rocket ship. Who should I aim for this time? So I aimed for me. I aimed for OB. Let's go for Spy Cakes. I know Spy Cakes lives in Canada. All right, maybe if I shoot this in Canada, it won't affect me in Pennsylvania. I have no idea. Let's see. Will this affect me? I I don't think it will, but maybe it will. I have no idea. Okay, sorry, Spy Cakes, but this might affect your videos for the next week. Okay, I don't know what's going on. Okay, this barely did any damage at all. Okay, it did a little bit of damage. That wasn't even... Oh. Uh, oh. Uh... Okay, I don't think I would have survived this, guys. I don't think I would have survived this. Nobody's alive! Oh! Uh, um... Uh... Okay, I think there's more people that I need to apologize than just spy cakes. We're now looking at the area in space where planet Earth used to exist. <laughs> I love how the game's like, nope. zero people survived. Thank you. Thank you, uh, game, for telling me that zero people survived. You know what? I would have thought that Uncle Lewis was floating in space somewhere just fine, untouched. Well, that might have been one of the most incredible things I've ever seen in my life. So now I'm going to do it in slow-mo. I want to see what this looks like in slow-mo. Okay, so I put it in slow-mo. Let's take the rocket ship. Guys, what is this? Let me know. This must be like an alien. I think that's what it is. It's an alien spaceship that comes to Earth and is like, nah. I don't like it that much. Let's explode the whole thing and turn it into a sun, basically. So let's press it. I'm going to aim. You know what? Can I do two? Wait, wait, wait. I want to reset it. Wait, wait. No, 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 no. Don't blow up the world. Okay, I don't think anybody died. Let's go back to slow-mo. Slow-mo. There we go. So now I'm aiming for Komodo. I've taken out me. I've taken out OB. I've taken out Spy Cakes. Let's go for Komodo this time. Actually, should we go for Kian? Kian lives in California. Nah, California's going through enough right now. Let's go for Komodo who lives in Texas. So I'm going to aim for like Texas slash Mexico. 
Here we go. I have it in slow-mo. I just want to see what this thing looks like. Okay, so here it comes. Here it comes. That is definitely some sort of an aircraft. It's definitely like a spaceship of some sort. Guys, let me know in the comments. What are your theories on what the heck this thing is? Uh-oh. Oh, no. I hit it twice. I hit it twice. Okay, let's see. Here it comes. Here it comes, because one wasn't enough. You know, disintegrating the Earth into smithereens wasn't enough with one. Let's try to blow it up twice. Okay, here we go. It's getting ready to explode everything. Like I said, more than Texas is about to explode from this. The entire Earth, the entire Earth is about- to Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go! Oh my goodness. Everybody died on impact. Instantly, everybody's dead. Look at this. So let me go to the other side of the Earth. Okay, the other side of the earth looks kind of okay, other than the fact that I can, you know, sort of see lava on the south pole. That's probably a problem. Let's check on Santa Claus up on the north pole. How's he doing? How's Santa doing? Oh, okay, yep, Santa Claus isn't doing too good either. Sa oh, look at this. You can see the cracks in the earth. Okay, this is what planet earth looked like before planet earth was planet earth. Like, this is what it looked like when it was being formed. I'll give you a little science lesson of the day. Oh my goodness. This is the coolest thing I've ever seen. Oh no, the other one. The other one's shooting off now. Okay, so there are two explosions going on right now. I don't know what's gonna happen. I, I mean, I look, I feel like I'm looking at the sun right now, but no, 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 that's not the sun. That would be the earth that we're all living on right now. This is terrible. Oh, I feel so bad for humanity. Any second now, the Earth is gonna completely just evaporate like water in the middle of the summer on a driveway. I, I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh, wait, let me zoom out, let me zoom out, let me zoom out. Oh my gosh. I'm fully zoomed out and it still takes up the entire screen. Komodo, you okay, buddy? It might get a little warm. I know Texas is warm, but this is gonna be unseasonably hot. Don't worry about it, it's normal. Komodo? Hey, Komodo! Okay, the last thing I wanna try, you guys told me in the comment section last time, Brandon, go to the futuristic world and try to blow that up. This one's got 13.172 billion people, guys. That's a lot of people. Let me try to blow this bad boy up. Let's do it! Let's go alien invasion! The aliens are now invading their own alien planet. Are we still in slow-mo? Where's the spaceship? Hey, aliens! I don't care if it's 10 million light years from Earth. Hurry it up, man! Did I not press it? Oh, there they come. There they come. Oh, I pressed it, all right. Can they really blow up a futuristic world with 13 billion people? This might be the future planet Earth. I really don't know what this is. I don't know why it's purple. Oh, my goodness. Everybody's dead. 13 people, 13 billion people just died like that. And look, the planet's gone. I mean, this planet looks like the sun again. I am so obsessed with Solar Smash. If you guys want to see more, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Check out my brand new vlog channel, TFG Vlogs. Go over there, subscribe, say hi to me in the comment section, and I will see all of you in the next video. I got to find a bigger planet. <laughs>